104.9. And that was our Mac Tracks for tonight. Started off with Joshua Ward th- with Sent Me You into One Ugly Cowboy. Yeah, I see you thought it was going to be a bike, didn't you? It's the ladies singing that one there. Don't mess around with the Southern Girl. And we finished it off with Milton Patton and The Breakup. And that is our Mac Track Triple Play. Happens at 9 o'clock every Wednesday night here on the Tracy and Big D Show. As you know, I'm a sucker for Australian talent. I always have been. And uh, I love our next guest every time we get the opportunity to catch up with her. But now I'm in awe of her talent for a little bit further now. Imagine if your best friend's getting married and you could just go and write a song for them. If I wrote a song, it'd be terrible. <laughs> this lady is so talented. It's the beautiful Jasmine Ray. And uh, her new song, and we'll be featuring it tonight, is When I Found You and she joins us now. You're just a talent, Jasmine. Oh, stop it. That's why I keep coming on. You guys are too, too nice. Thank you. Yeah, see, it's, it, doesn't help. it doesn't help. It doesn't hurt when you're good looking either. He likes the girls. Oh, the, uh, well, you guys are super good looking. Thank oh, you. Well, that's why we're on I radio. And you're on album uh, covers. <laughs> and I'm on the phone. Uh, yeah, it's a very... <laughs> I'm always on the phone. Um, it's a, Yeah, it's a very special song to me when I found you. It actually wasn't originally going to be on the record. It was just a song that, of course, being a musician, that I wrote uh, with a couple of friends of mine the weekend before the wedding. So I'm like, oh, my God, I'm singing. I need to sing something. And so we, we kind of wrote it very quickly the weekend before, and it just fell out, and it was fate. Um, that it that it was supposed to happen like that, and um, yeah, I just couldn't get it out of my head, and so uh, I'm so glad it actually got onto the album. That must be so special for your friend Amber that you've been able to put this as a gift that's there forever now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was really, really special. Amber and I, we were we became best friends in kindergarten, and so we were playing in the sand pit together, you know, way back when, and we kind of grew up just. Planning our weddings as you do, putting on really terrible makeup in you know, when you're eight years old, talking about it, one day I'm gonna marry a prince and all that stuff. And so it was really cool to to be able to see her get married to the love of her life and to be able to sing this song which is now so very special to me and she cried all her expensive makeup off performing it and so um yeah, she got the airbrush makeup. Oh done, yeah. And we all got it done because uh, we were bridesmaids and um yeah, the tears um, just washed all that away pretty quickly. But, um, but, yeah, it was a great day, really good day. Oh, you give me goosebumps. And, of course, um, you're in the middle of the Heartbreak Tour. You're finishing it off for the end of the year. You've just finished it up here in Queensland. So that's it for the Heartbreak Tour up here in Queensland. But you've still got plenty of dates down in New South Wales and Victoria to go, haven't you? We do. Well, we haven't actually done the full um, – it's actually the Heartbeat but we haven't actually done the full uh, Queensland leg of the tour yet. So um, we will be heading up to Queensland very, very soon, I hope. But we've got some New South Wales dates ah. to do so. Yeah. So we're, coming, we're expecting to see some more of Jasmine, are we? Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, good. Uh, especially now that it's getting warmer. That's my favourite time. You know, actually, Queensland is always such beautiful weather. I'm from Melbourne, so whenever I'm there, I'm just like, yay, this is what it feels like to wear a singlet again. Hooray. <laughs> and so, um, yeah. I cannot wait to come on back up. For those who don't know, we had the opportunity to spend a bit of time with Jasmine at the uh, CMC Awards earlier on this year. Yeah. And uh, just, a, just a load of fun. And hopefully CMC will be a big part of uh, next year for you and the awards again. Oh, it was such a fantastic night. It was so great that we got to hang out. And CMC have been such a, a big supporter of this album. Uh, Heartbeat went to number one. And I was like, really, you guys are just the best. And so the video was actually me... Well, at uh, Bethany, who is my my alter ego in the video, was eating, uh, destroying cakes in the kitchen and eating them while having a crying fit. And so that video was so fun to make, and so it was so great that CMC got behind it and played it and played it and played it. It was very, it was really great of them. Now, a couple of years ago, we um, we caught up, and one of the things you told us that you had an ambition of playing the harmonica. Yes. And oh, I, did I? Wow. Yep. Yes, you did. And I turned oh, wow. on about oh, four months ago, I suppose. I turned on CMC, mm-hmm. and there's Jasmine Ray doing a live performance playing the harmonica. And I thought, how good is that? That's goal setting for you. How's that yeah. all going for you? It's uh, You know, I, I have always loved the harmonica. I had um, Laurie Minson in my band for a long time, who is an incredible mm. harmonica player, as well as many other things, songwriter and guitarist and 
And so I'm like, I really need to step up my game. And so I kind of spent quite a few months practicing harmonica in the air brakes, Dr. <laughs> Phil. Sorry, practicing watching television. What? Um, yeah, so I was just doing that while I was watching Kelly and eventually, you know, I could play a couple of tunes and it's so fun to be able to do that. I actually played it uh, while I was on tour with Adam Brand last year and it was just so it was great to be able to do that. Yeah, have a lot of fun with it. For anything that you want at all, go head on to all the W's at jasmineray.com. <laughs> you can grab your tickets to any of the Jasmine Ray 2015 Heartbeat Tours. You can get a hold of the new single. You can go over to iTunes. There is no excuse not to have a piece of Jasmine Ray in your collection somewhere. Well, it, I think this is my favourite album. I'm not being biased. So if you're going to get one, give, you know, give this one a go. Give it a listen and let me know what you think. I'm on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram all the time. So when you have a listen to the album, lots of people are saying that it's probably the most positive of all my album so when you have a listen to it please let me know what you think because i would love to hear all your thoughts well let's have a listen right now here is jasmine ray her newest single when i found you